Hello, this is Synthetic Programming with another tutorial. This one is actually the start of a series, which is pretty much a long string of tutorials on how to program batch files. So, if you haven't watched our other video on an example of a batch file, a batch file is pretty much a file with the extension .bat, which is a window that comes up which executes commands. And there's a whole list of these commands. There's tons of them. You can look them up online, you can look them up from inside the command prompt on your computer, and this string of commands can be used for pretty much anything. In this tutorial, I'll just be showing you the basics, and then as we progress, it'll get a little more in-depth. So to start off, we're going to make a new text document, and we're just going to call this tutorial. So this is going to be where we program, or where we put our code. The first thing you're going to want to do when creating a batch file is you want to start with the at echo off. Now, this is kind of like when programming HTML, your declaration at the beginning that's uh, a hash that says exclamation point doc type HTML, which kind of tells the program what kind of code it should be running. This is kind of like what the at echo off does. Another command we're going to learn is the color command. So you can actually change the color by typing color and I like 0A because 0A is green and it looks like you know your stereotypical hacker. I really enjoy it. There are other people who like to change it to things like white on red, purple on blue. Everyone likes something different. I prefer this bright green so that's what we're gonna go with. The next command is the echo command, which is simply to print something. So echo hello world. That's going to print hello world. Now, we're going to save this really quickly so I can show you something. We're going to do save as tutorial.bat. We're going to save it to all files. So when we save it, it comes up here, and when we click it, as you can see, it flashes in, but then it flashes out really fast. I'll do it one more time so you can see. Now this is because we haven't told the program to pause. All it's been told to do is to go here, 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 and then quit. So if we want it to pause and let us see it, we simply type pause. Now if I save this, as our dot bat you'll see that the program pauses so it says hello world press any key to continue so let's hit enter we hit enter it turns off this is the very basic part of batch files this is telling it to speak right here telling it to change color right here declaring that it's a batch file right here and then just simply telling it to pause. In the next tutorial, I'll go into some deeper commands, some more difficult commands, and I'll explain how you can actually skip lines. Thank you. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for the next tutorial.